Of all the inventions in the 20th century, perhaps none had more impact on society than the creation of television. Known as the golden age of television, at no other time was television as influential on American society as during the 1950s. The 1950s television era was when television became prevalent in American households, providing middle-class families with a window into current events, advertising, and entertainment in a way that hadn't been possible before. According to surveys, approximately 3.1 million people had TV sets in the 50s. For the first time, advertising, entertainment, and news was accessed in the home with moving images and sound. Television in the 1950s was a major turning point in American culture and society because it provided knowledge of important current events, changed consumerism, and affected people's goals on how to look and dress. Although news broadcasting via radio was already popular, the event of televised news during the 1950s not only provided knowledge of important events, but added a new visual dimension to the broadcasts. Live news was now not only heard, but seen by the American public, eventually impacting politics by televising live debates and important political issues such as the civil rights movement. While television provided an alternative news source for the Americans, it also had the effect of biasing the public through the images that were shown. The first presidential advertisement premiered in 1952 by Dwight Eisenhower and has continued to be a primary advertising medium for politicians. In addition, by the time of the first televised presidential debate in 1960, people were basing their opinion of candidates on body language and physical appearance more than perhaps their political stance. In conclusion, 1950s television provided real-time access to information, therefore providing the public with knowledge of current events such as politics, breaking news, and other important news items. The economy was strong during the post-war era of the 1950s. Advertisers wasted no time using television to sell their goods and services. One way this was done was by featuring products on popular television shows, often to convince homemakers to purchase household items such as cleaning products and food products such as coffee. Celebrities were often used to speak directly about a sponsored product. This gave the product more credibility. Many commercials still use this tactic today. For instance, the same celebrity from the 1950s, Betty White, can still be seen in television advertising campaigns, such as the Super Bowl Snickers commercial. Television advertising has had the same effect of fueling conspicuous consumption as well. Middle-class families were presented with an ideal of what a middle-class family should look like. Ideas about cars, appliances, clothing, and other consumer items were influenced by television commercials and programs. Therefore, 1950s television greatly influenced consumerism through product-sponsored television programs, celebrity endorsements, and entertainment itself. One result of television's influence on consumerism was the way in which it dictated trends particularly in fashion. Television actors often set the trends for hairstyles and clothing choices. Men and women would mimic the styles by purchasing what they saw on TV, fueling more commercialism. Some of the greatest fashion trends were geared toward teenagers, one of the largest growing consumer demographics of the era. Teenage peer pressure was strong during the 1950s, with television providing ideas about how teenagers should dress and behave. In conclusion, 1950s television was a major turning point in history because it changed American life on many levels. Television became the primary source of information, ideas, and opinions for millions of Americans. Over time, the role of television has become an even more integral part of American life. This topic connects to the theme of History Day, or a turning point in history. 
Consumerism has been drastically changed because of the invention of television, commercials, and sellers' strategies. Television news broadcasting helps us know the latest current events even as they are unfolding. It also affects the way that we think of ourselves, the things we want, and the role in society. More obviously, it entertains us when we have nothing to do. Without this turning point, life today would be much different.